everybody. One of the things that a lot of people ask me is, Coach, can I see your team play? So I put together this small video of my team playing this year in some of our matches. As you can see through our game model here, we're really a, a possession-oriented team. However, we're not a pure positional play team. We don't have to build through each third of the field. If the counterattack is on, we're always happy to use the counterattack because we did have a lot of speed superiorities this year. And this is what I do is I flip in this video from our game model to our training session. So this is a 10v5 one touch where it works on really moving the ball with the team of 10 as the other team of five works on pressing. So again, another clip here of us keeping possession of the ball, trying to move that defense from side to side. If it's not on, we continue to keep the ball. And this will shift into, here's a sample training session here. This is 3v1, one touch only. After X amount of passes, we get it to the other side. And there's constant variability in all our training sessions with possession. But you can see here, this is another one where we're attracting players in. All the players come in. We keep the ball. We keep the ball. And then we look to switch. Here's game model. If you notice, the forward comes in between the lines, one touch. And then we're off to the races there. And here's a training session here. This is game model training session. It's actually the same guy, right? The same striker makes the same run. Really, really nice. And you could see one of our strikers was very, very quick. So he was always in and behind. And that's a huge speed superiority there. Looking again for a good counterattack. You see the striker up top, how quick he is. Speed superiority. Nice counterattack. Here's a training exercise, works possession, after X number of passes, we can release the ball into a superiority of numbers. Another game model here, attacking at speed, superiority and speed again, right there gets in behind. Example of training, this is a counter pressing exercise when they lose the ball in the middle. And here you could see we lost the ball, so here's our counter press. We press with numbers, try to take angles away, passing angles away, and we end up winning the ball. So I hope you enjoyed that video. Again, that was my team from this year, 2022. They were the 2022 national champions in Division I men's JUCO. So the team ended up doing very well. And always a reminder, you're on the station now, but to subscribe, 900 plus free videos, and this takes you through at least the last eight, nine years of my college training sessions um, are all on this channel. So I appreciate you watching. And now you guys got a chance to see my team play. And I'll probably end up doing a little bit more of those in the future.